if I see a titty pop out, it's like, all right, I gotta, I gotta get it going a little bit. I kept my fob key when I used to live da- when we moved from downtown. Yeah. Uh, I kept the fob for the garage because they, they had guest parking. Yeah. Oh yeah, I just I, I just paid the thirty five dollars. Yeah. Kept oh, it. Yeah, exactly. Smart, yeah, yeah, yeah. Kept it. So that's what cheaper I, than what I, I've heard other ones like four hundred bucks. Like, yeah. Hey, four hundred. After four hundred might still be worth it though. After I watched, the, after I watched Gone in sixty seconds. And they had this little like doodad, electronic doodad that like when someone opens up their garage door, it sends out the signal, and then they like point the doodad right. at it, and it like gets the code and shit. Ever since I seen that, I always look around when I open my garage. I'm like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's such like a uh, like um, Hollywood magic. Yeah. Like everything, That's legit, every, every, everything that hackers know, but like a lot of shit that yeah. hackers enhance, do in movies. enhance, yeah, yeah, yeah. enhance. Like, like you can just do it like, anytime they need a problem solved. It's like oh, some dude just like. Yeah. Types in a few fucking lines of code and that's it. It's or always the same. They'll thing. be on the street and they're like, "You see that camera? Hack that camera!" Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, is it on a network? Yeah. Is it it's CCTV? Or, or the like, one where they open up the cabinet with all the cords and then they like splice one and then put like an interceptor in there and then leave. Yeah, and it's yeah. like, wait, what? Like you could just no, no. I don't think we could do that. I don't think that's real. <laughs> but my favorite is like the in the movie Hackers when they're like just literally just guessing the passwords and that's their like their yeah like. The fact that like like this whole massive hack that's going on is like all oh, a bunch of hackers just literally like typing in these like yeah. random passwords and it works. Like what do you? Like, no they way. Just run, they run scripts. They just run our scripts. Yeah. It's all it's all HTML, bro. It's like MySpace. It's all it's all MySpace. Yeah. It'd be cool to make all the the uh, the traffic lights green at your own will. I, I was wondering how how secure that is. The traffic that's, light one? System. It's got to be secure, right? Well, like, people are breaking into <laughs> banks and shit. Yeah. Like, and they're know. changing the, the construction signs uh, from caution, slow down, to suck my yeah. dick. Yeah. Biden. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. I like, mean, I don't think that's, like, pumped into, like, the city. You just like, do that on the side of the road. Remember, you just go up to it. Yeah. Really? Yeah, you can, yeah. Put, you can put whatever you want. Remember, oh, that's yeah. funny. You just walk up to it. You remember people used to say, like, if you flashed your fucking brights at, like, the stoplight, it would yeah. change it? Yeah. Those are all myths, right? Yeah. Wait, is it a myth that uh, when the, like, nine, when, you know, emergency service, are coming through they can change the light i've always heard i don't know if that's true i know it's not because i always watch for that yeah and no they're they're, um, they're, they're, they're yeah. staying red yeah yeah May, uh, maybe so like maybe like in the immediate area there's an automatic trigger because i've noticed in pb when they come out of that um that firehouse like they just go through a few stoplights no problem even uh-huh. like, even all the way up to fanuel well there. the firehouse makes sense though because yeah they have to get as out soon quick. as the doors are opening up it probably triggers and yeah, they can yeah, just get out exactly yeah but yeah like way down like you know a mile down the road yeah. probably not because i've heard it like any light they hit like a button and it changes no no that's way, what i've heard no. yeah do you guys remember the myth i don't know if you guys ever heard this so you take the t- a tennis ball and you poke a hole in it to unlock your door your car door you put the tennis ball and the hole against like the keyhole, and then you hit the hit the tennis ball really hard, and something about the pressure pops the lock. No, no, no? That. That was, have you heard it? This must no, no, been no, popular yeah. in the seventies. Let's, let's give it a try. No, yeah, that work on a Civic or something like a yeah. It was yeah. Civic. Or... It was like a nineties thing, and like a couple people did it. I think in a movie or like you know like on a video, and everyone was like, "Wait, what?" I've never tried it, but I was just curious. well. I feel like that was when when the locks were when you pull it up. Like no cars have that anymore. Now it's yeah. like oh, it was probably you, one you, car model. Just have like the the metal hook, the whatever it was. Like yeah, but, yeah. I, but I just mean probably that that process was something to do with that going up. You know, because now they don't have that. Uh, probably for good reason, right? Because people are using hangers and shit to yeah. Well, especially with like three D printers know. now, because you have to you have to actually like register when you would buy one of those, right? A three D like printer? No, 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 no. Oh, the, 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 like, no, what? I'm, ta- I'm talking about the um the whatever they were the. Uh, Slim Jims or whatever. Yeah, Slim Jim. Uh, That's what it was called, right? Oh uh, yeah. yeah you have to register. Well, you you yeah. You Bitch, I'm out here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm stealing. <laughs> <laughs> It's one of those things like if you ordered it, they're looking around like, all right, we gotta watch this motherfucker. <laughs> like, New career. Yeah. Robin. Can I print? <laughs> <laughs> Robin. <laughs> Same guy walking into Ace Hardware buying zip ties and a fucking axe. Yeah, and, like, it's a, a duct crowbar. Tape. And, like, don't even yeah. don't even look well, at me. What's crazy when you watch those murder docs, a lot of them they they do dumb shit like that. Where they buy everything at one spot. Yeah. I need lime and a shovel and duct tape. You guys got plastic body bags? Get some cash out of the ATM, you fucking weirdo. The clerk doesn't even ask. The clerk's just like, yeah, whatever. It's Halloween. The the irony is people are like, 
the least suspicious of the people that you need to be suspicious of. And like, they like get like super paranoid about like just random people walking by. Yeah. Like somebody was making this point about, about like, um, like the security cameras, like the, um, what are the, uh, ones on the front door, the, uh, um, oh, like ring, ring, ring cams. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And he was like, he's like, you would, people get like super paranoid because they have it like every time, Something moves, it, it like triggers to like to your uh, yeah, sends on, the yeah. message to your phone or whatever. Yeah. And he's like, he's like, I realized when I was doing that, like I was getting super like suspicious of every single person who would like just walk up and take a look. He's like, sometimes people are probably just looking for like an address. Well, yeah. look somewhere else, bitch. <laughs> look at yeah. your fucking phone. That shit, bitch. It's just like day. behind the door. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are way too chill. <laughs> fucking, I'm in the house every fucking time somebody drives by. The curtains get ripped back. I got an <laughs> AR back the hip. You guys are crazy. You come up my door. Who is it? It's like that picture of Malcolm X peeking out the blind. Yeah. Every day. <laughs> every I day. wish I was joking. I wish I was joking. It's wild at my house. Fuck that. Dude, I got cameras everywhere. They're always going. I off. have cameras too. My cameras are always, dude. A fucking, there's this little like daddy long leg in the garage yeah. that like makes his web right in front of the camera. <laughs> bro, the first time that shit happened at 2 a.m., bro, I was like, oh, daddy bro, long leg? Because your cameras are that sensitive? Oh, yeah, right in front of it. The daddy long's like building a web because it's in the corner. So gotcha. the, the spider Sounds builds like a web. Sounds like a plot. Somebody's going to break in eventually. <laughs> no, yeah, that, that's a <laughs> trick. Daddy, daddy long, long leg. Yeah, picture. yeah. <laughs> So the first time, like, it, it, during the day, it goes off all the time because my girlfriend's in the garage coming in and out. There's someone dropping off an Amazon package, so I'm used to it. So, but when I go to sleep, it never, every once in a while, someone might, might walk by the front door and it picks up. But that one night, it was probably like two or three months after I actually got the security system that it went off at 2 a.m., bro. Bro, What's up, the first yeah. time I ever had to get up and grab my gun and run downstairs. And wow. then, yeah, dude. Shoddy's I'm about to start blasting the spider. <laughs> <laughs> hey, front roll onto the oh Lexus, my goodness. bro. <laughs> um, yeah, so it's just, now it'll go off and I'll look and I'm like, oh, it's the fucking that spider. Drill that drill music, bro. That, that, that's the homie. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's the homie. My girlfriend's like, kill it. Dude, I, uh, my fucking smoke detector went off at like three in the morning. Boom, gun. <laughs> <Bah, bah. laughs> like in the movies when they shoot the fucking uh, alarm clock. The alarm clock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, dude, that shit like scared the fuck out of me. I'm like out of like a dead sleep, fucking. Bro, you know, like, so the yeah. worst. Yeah, and like the like the first thing on my mind is because we had our friend's place burned down. Like that, I mean, it wasn't. That's the that worst. Recently, but like in my mind, I'm like. I'm like, dude, my shit, like, somebody's fucking left their shit on, like, the whole complex is going up and smoking. Grab my porn stash! Yeah. <laughs> and and her, shit, her shit went up because there was two extension cords <gasps> put together. Uh, and they, it was, like, bad, bad extension cords. Nothing, nothing to do with them. They Wait, were this is the same story? I mean, I'm assuming we're talking about the same person. Probably. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, but they fuck. had two extension cords, and uh, the there were two people that lived there. One of the people went to go walk the dog and uh, came back and... Completely everything. So up. literally, just two extension cords. You're not supposed to put. I, I don't. I mean, I don't know if I don't okay. know if you are or aren't supposed to do that. But I mean, we did it in construction all the time, which yeah. was fine. But it was a faulty cord. Though. That's the because okay. yeah. they had somebody come out like from insurance, and yeah. then the fire inspector comes, and he said it was the cord for sure. Yeah, that that can get sketchy. Get them fucking bullshit ass cords off of Amazon, man. Probably, yes, yes. Chinesiums, dude. Bro, we then we started a revolution for less. Yeah, bro. <laughs> Hit China right now, hey, bro. That was so a shit. faulty cord. I got faulty I, I gotta, cord. I gotta, I gotta go home. I just got a fucking surge protector from Amazon. <laughs> See, bro, no, dude. Bro. Spend, yeah. hey, spend money on your surge protectors, a hundred percent, man. My studio upstairs. Over the years, I've upgraded all my cables, and my girlfriend asked me because I'll be like, "Damn, I gotta get another cable. That's like ninety bucks." What? She's like, $90 for a cable. I was like, I just, I spent all this money, all this yep. equipment, my home, I own it. Like, I might as well spend $90 on a good cable. 100%. 100%, 100%. dude. Or you got to get the Furman uh, power strips and shit. They're like 100 bucks, but it's like anything happens, they pop off. Yeah. Well, imagine, imagine the power goes out or something stupid. You come back home and all your shit's gassed. Yeah. All Dude, your that, electronic shit. That's, yeah. that's like always in my head when I was coming back from Europe because you're gone for so long. You're just like, either, either like it's up in smoke or like or, 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 or it's been looted. <laughs> oh, I, I flipped the breakers. Like, there's nothing I did, yeah. in there. Like, <laughs> <laughs> got squatters and shit. Like the farther away you get from home and the longer you're away, like the more in your head you're like, oh, I got yep. squatters in there. Yep. Looters have come through. Like. Do you When you left for Europe, do you unplug your TV? Like how far do you get in? Into it. Yeah, they um, left this toaster on. I left the oven on in case anybody tried to break in. Hey, <laughs> light them up. Boom. Yeah. Because <laughs> I always I I unplug the TV, my PC, 
uh like some of the like the electronics all the alexa things like all my uh fire cubes yeah, and shit I, t- I basically unplugged like anything that like would sort of be on in the background yeah. dude i've never done that you're well, crazy you're, you're in an apartment bro fuck it Whatever. Well, that's like the worst <laughs> part about being in the. No, but I'm serious. I mean, man. I got renters insurance. So yeah, you know what I mean? yeah that's, you're that's good. You I can yeah. like new homes, man. You can like turn off the water. You can turn off the main electricity and shit. But I don't old know. homes too. <laughs> I'm yeah. old house. Yeah, turn everything But it's off. easy. Like new homes, dude. All my shits in the garage in like one area. Oh, I can just yeah. like just a hammer and a like, wrench. You you could be <laughs> you, you could be walking you could be walking down my alley and flip every single breaker in my car. Hey, good to know. Yeah, that's so dumb. Halloween night. Hell yeah. You and me, Halloween I'll, night. I'll, oh, I'm down. Oh, it, it, it should, it should <laughs> all of a sudden you see pff, everything goes up. And so, oh shit! It should <laughs> definitely be in like a maintenance closet. Exactly, <laughs> not, not accessible to fucking any civilian. Yeah. Does he have a lock on it? No. Oh my god! I don't think we should air this episode. <laughs> <laughs> this is putting Alex well, in mine's danger. Mine's also right? out. It's outside of my house and outside of the gate. Yeah. And there's no like lock on it. I'm like, this is what, what is this about? Hey man, have a gate guard. Twenty four seven. Why hey, why is the guard I gotta be gay, homie? It's gate. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a gay guard. I got a gay guard, homie. Freeze. <laughs> the, the funny thing is there's no like uh marking for like the markings on the on the panels don't match up for the units. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. So wow. like anytime I've had an issue and I've had to go flip it, I'm like like paranoid I'm gonna flip someone else's and not yeah. mine, you know. I hate like, fucking with uh, electricity, man. I fuck it. I, I I switch out some of my outlets to the USB outlet, like in the kitchen, so oh, I yeah. can just plug in my fuck phone. That, I'm hiring somebody. But yeah, oh, man, yeah. I I did, I, look, I looked over you all the YouTube. Pussies. Have you, you seen Home Alone? Crazy. When he oh turned into a skeleton, God. that's real, that's bro. Real, yeah, that's, <laughs> real. that's how it works. <laughs> and no, fucking as breaker. long as you, I I get one of the uh, the testers, so you pop it in the thing and yeah, it shows but can you, you zero. really trust those? Yeah, For, you can from trust Amazon. That. Are you crazy? <laughs> Y'all are China. crazy. He's got a Chinese freaking electricity you tester. Can't even did, you, did, you, did, you, did you buy that on Amazon? I had to change my tire the other day, fool. <laughs> the baby gentleman. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, damn. I actually, yeah, I had somebody from uh, from TaskRabbit come over and do the behind the wall shit for the TV. Oh, that's, yeah, yeah. That but sucks because you fuck that yeah. up. Like, you don't want to fuck your wall And up. it's a pain in the ass. Like, I, I have that's a what I'm saying, dude. It cost me 80 bucks. I'm like, that's it takes worth a while. it. Yeah. yeah, like, you can do it. It just takes a while. Yeah, yeah. like, I would, like that, it took that guy, like, less than an hour. Yeah. And when it probably would, I would have had to buy the tools to do it, and it would have taken me like that was your first was bro. We, all right, right after the show, we're all going to fucking Home Depot. I have I'm no gonna tools. get you guys a little tool kit. Don't look at me, fool. Yeah, I'm looking at no, you too. I do shit. I, 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 you I, see I, these cut off sleeves, homie? I lift shit. <laughs> I got wood in my garage, bro. I'm building shit. <laughs> the fuck out of here. I, I don't shit. have like the fucking saw thing that's cutting through the drywall. You don't, like, you, you don't need a saw. You just need a little fucking a jigsaw. Little knife. No, you don't nah, need all that. Get a jigsaw. Do it the right way. You literally need like a razor blade knife. That's a it. razor blade? I got some thick ass drywall. Who so. the fuck worked construction in here? <laughs> who the fuck? I worked construction like 10 years. All right, all right, my bad, bro. Who, you, you gotta, I, I forgot you gotta who I was talking to. Next episode, we're gonna see if you can get through with the box cutter. <laughs> I will. Uh, no, he's right, though. He's right. You can do the box cutter through the drywall. The comments are fucking furious right now. <laughs> construction workers are like, these fucking idiots. <laughs> I went to school for this shit. You they don't know what they're talking about. <laughs> My bad, man. I thought you needed that. The hanging TVs is weird, though, because I know if I hang my own TV, I'm going to look at it and be like, fuck, is it like, is it crooked? Like, I, I, have this, I have this inner fear of it just falling off the fucking wall one day. <laughs> Same. And then I'm like, I just have a fear, man. I Same. mean, you put, Sorry. you put it in the studs, you're fine. Like, get a level. Oh, my God. I'm losing my shit. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> just to be clear, just to be oh clear, I, I, I did my, I hang my own, I hang my own TV. So. <laughs> I did. I, I hung my own. You be proud of me, Scoob. You've been to the crib. I hung both of them. Bro, it's hard to hang like, 84 oh, inch, baby. Mine was 62. Fair enough. You know I mean? oh, see, a 62 easy, oh, bro. Okay, 84. Woo, I need to w- call the homies for that. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, Scoop, I'm sorry, man. But he calls I mean, baby gentlemen. Baby Jesus gentlemen. Christ. We're grandpas, but no, no grandkids. No fucking skills. All right, let's talk about auto- automotive shit. Do you change your own oil? No, 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 no. Okay. I mean, cool. just because it's that. Okay, the reason why. See? See? Oh, you know what a real reason? man. Yeah. I changed my own oil. Bitch, I'll change everyone's oil in this fucking room <laughs> before the show's over. Keep talking that shit. He didn't even have a car. He's talking about yeah. your ass. I, I, <laughs> <laughs> you, can wipe my, you can wipe my ass in the bathroom later. <laughs> 
See, so what? You don't no, care no, no, your no, no. fucking big oil and you're difference. giving a shit? <laughs> big difference, big difference. You all, have, you're, all you gotta do is take the knob off. Negative, negative, negative. You have to get the oil, then you have to dispose. You can't just dump it down the drain. You have to yeah, dispose of it. You yeah, you can. <laughs> oh, he has a PB. He's I pouring mean, it in you the can do fucking it. ocean. <laughs> okay, yeah, but... but and it's a little bit of a pain in the ass, and it's not that much more expensive just to pay somebody to do it. Bullshit, it's, cheap, it's, it's way cheap. more. Well, bro, bro yeah, you got you the fucking Ferrari race car. Get the fuck yeah, out of yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's way, I do it myself. I yeah. save. Well, yeah, because you probably save hundreds of dollars. I, I, where, I, I hey, somebody like asked you, where do you put the oil, homie? What? Where do you put the oil? Who do you mean where do you put old oil. The old oil. Oh, don't Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. I'll say it. I'll say it. I'm not doing that crazy stuff. I'm talking to Dom. Dom's like, whenever I get booked to spin at a boost cruise, you might you might see an oil slick fucking running by my motherfucker. I go to the amenity part of my apartment to dump it in the sink. This motherfucker. He's like, no, I don't. he's like, he's like Andy Duf- he's like Andy Dufresne. He's got a tube coming down. And he's just emptying it out of his fucking pant leg as he's walking down the street. Yeah, as he's walking. Because I, am, I know you ain't taking it to the proper I'm spot. Not. Yes, I am. Yes, I okay, am. where? I'm going to my, I go to my friend's house. Okay, and uh, he's got like four of those uh, oil fucking collectors. Yeah, where they come like pick yeah. it up. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So he just invites okay. himself yeah. over, then drops it off in their side yard. I do. And watch my car, hang out, play with his kids, his dog. It's a good time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Good, good, good. All right. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, like, yeah, okay, yeah. How, how long does it take you though to, to, to change your oil? All right, now we're now okay, Alex. Chill out. Now well, we're getting well, no, into this, who this, cares, this is what man. Scoop's talking about. It's the it's the convenience. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I'd say a good 30, 45 minutes. Oh, that's yeah. fucking yeah. Yeah, and I'm letting my car sit. I let my car sit because they're not going to do that when you go get your oil changed. They're going to park it, drain it, and that's it. I let yeah, my they car do it sit. all quick. Yeah. Oh, so they, they let the old oil like go all the way. Like, I do all the way out. Oh, you do. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. When you take it to a place, they're not going to let your car yeah, sit yeah. like that. So if I, I had your sit. car, I would do that. Yeah. yeah let a car sit. Yeah. You know what I mean? Let it cool down. Why don't you, you, know, why don't you just tell me your preferences? Be like, yo, I need you to like, <laughs> like, fuck you. Hell no, dude. <laughs> my preferences. That's how, that, that's how you get shit stolen out of your glove box, homie. <laughs> this is my preference. I'd rather, no. Yeah, those yeah, AirPods like, be disappearing quick. Hell yeah. <laughs> well, you, you take it to the dealership when you would do that shit? No, I take it to a BMW BMW tech. But I, I change my own oil. I do a lot. Of, I've done most of the work on my car. I've done it myself. Because you have you have that spot you have a friend yeah I got like a, a, I got a couple yeah. friends yeah. Yeah. so yeah, yeah, yeah. Dom I was talking to you about I took my Lexus to the actual dealership and Oof. like yeah everyone's like are you serious but this might be another myth but I thought that if you take your car to like where you bought it or a dealership of the same company. It's it, your car's worth more if you go that's to sell not a it. Ferrari, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's like, that's relax, like, that's Jody. Like Porsche. <laughs> you relax. You have a you have a Japanese car that came off the assembly line. Like, <laughs> you're about sixty grand fucking Fuck under. You, <laughs> <laughs> fucking you, don't, you, you don't have some Italian guy with like a screwdriver yeah. fucking <laughs> doing it from scratch. Bro, I'm fucking serious. No, 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 I, I, there is, I there bet, is a little truth to that, there right? Is truth to that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And I bet if you, like, especially if you found the right buyer, say you price it higher than yes. it's worth, you were selling it, there's and probably someone they, really they appreciate do, they it. They do keep the records. Yeah, they, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've Thank seen you. people that, yeah, yeah they so I show the you with if the I'm, records. If yeah. I'm trying to sell it at top price and the guy's like, oh, I don't know, I'm like, check this out. I've taken it to Lexus yeah, for yeah. the last three years. And he knows you're not doing 10,000 miles out of oil change. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, I mean, that's true. That helps. Okay, cool. That'll get you, like, 5,500 instead of 5,000. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's five hundred bucks. Bills are cheap. You're, you're, spe- you're spending more paying at the dealership, probably. Oh yeah, than dude. You would well, get in yeah. it's funny because I was talking to Dom. I was like, man, I t- just like I think it was during the pandemic when I was like fucking broke, and I was like, yo, dude, I'm gonna start taking my shit to like another another place. And you gave me some you know recommendations, but when I took it to this other spot in Little Italy, it was like more than half price. I was like, fuck. Yeah, and you, they man. were like Lexus certified. I was like, god damn, bro. But whatever. Well, now you know. Yeah, I do. No, know, no, never no, take no. your car to the fucking dealership, people. Yeah. And they always, <laughs> Unless it's you know under what's warranty. Funny? You know what's funny is they always give me like a, a 5% discount. <laughs> yeah, bro. It's a 5%. Oh, military? 5%. Ten, like, thank you for your that, service. That's like when you go to Macy's and everything's on sale. Yeah. 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 It's so it's expensive gap. as fuck. Or yeah. not the gap. Old Navy. Old Navy. Yeah. Every, it's always 30% like, off. That's just yeah. the price now. Yeah, that's, that's just the price. Bro, that's how Express got me, man. Because I had to go get my phone fixed. So I walked in Express, you know what I'm saying, kill some time. I was like, oh, shit, buy a pair of jeans, get 
get the uh, next pair 50% off. Yeah. Buy a shirt 50% off. I was like, all right, cool, bet. Got two pants and two shirts. It was still $220. <laughs> I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> this, is why, this is why I like H&M. There's like no discounts. Like, this is cheap. Just get it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. for real. H&M's a spot, bro. Yeah, the yeah. dealership. I, I was going to buy, this is maybe like a year ago. I was going to buy that uh, Porsche Panamera before people freak out. It was like 20, I think it was a 2012, the one I wanted. Yeah. And they're like, it, they're, you know, quote unquote affordable. It's like 30 grand, right? And there's a bunch of them. They're really nice. They look super nice. I yep. That's like my favorite fucking car that's of all time. my favorite car. And uh, that's the only, I think we talk about it. That's the only car I could ever get in and not put the seat all the way back. It's mm-hmm. like the hatchback, Just, the Porsche ha- hatchback. Yeah, right? kind of hatchback. One of the coaches oh. has one. Oh, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, I was going to talk to him. So, oh, he's the one who told me what was up. So before I, when I was going to buy it, then we did talking about the dealership shit. It was like, yeah, the the oil. They, that guy was telling me he's like, the oil changes are eight hundred bucks. He was like, I spent you know fifty five hundred this year on this. Every ten thousand miles, you gotta take it in for a service. It's like six oh. grand. Oh my Bro, god, I, I'm I, so glad I didn't buy it, dude. I finally talked to someone that had one. And he broke down everything, and I came to terms. I was like, I cannot afford this car. So Never, is it yeah. the reason they do that? Is because they want a higher class? Yeah, uh, they don't want poor people having. Yeah, they don't want yeah, poor people yeah, buying those literally. cars, right? Yeah, yeah I think you told me that. Yeah, yeah. It's so like it's the true, same right? You can yeah. buy like a used Mercedes. And look like you have more money than you actually do, versus like yeah. you can't just do that with a fucking Porsche or like a Ferrari. Yeah, or man. I mean, yeah. let, 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 let the lower live. people ball, man. Yeah, man. Please, <laughs> hey, please, bro. Because yeah, I, I really wanted one, and then when he broke everything down, I was like, "There's no way I can afford that." Because thirty G's is like, oh, okay, yeah, like I could pull that, you know. Ooh. And then it's like, okay, well, this is gonna cost me ten thousand every year on bro, top. He of dodged that. a bullet right yeah. there. He told yeah, me since yeah. he had it, he spent uh, like I, I would say like fifty grand. Hey, and how much? Like uh, that's like years. looking at a, an affordable fucking condo where you're like, oh, that's that's a good price, and then the HOA is like fifteen hundred a month. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you're like, yeah, no, bro, what the fuck? Uh, dude? Like, come yeah, on, yeah, literally. That was my life in 2020, dude. When I was looking for a place before I bought mine. Oh, this is cool. This is affordable. And then downtown, Little Italy, seven hundred, eight hundred dollars for HOA. That's the, crazy. The, 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 the irony is that actually does drop the price down. The decreases the value. In the same way that higher property taxes decreases the value of a house. But really? check this out. With yeah. HOA in, in a place downtown, like, what the fuck are you paying Bro, for? Bro, that's my question exactly. You're paying there, for there's no yard. people walking yeah. around. Yeah. Yeah. That, that, good, that well, fresh you're, piss you're, you're smell. Pay, you're, you're paying for all, like, the, the common areas, which you do have a shit ton of. But also, do like, you know? if something goes bad in a building like that, that's expensive as fuck to fix. Yep. Like it's for, that's their problem. <laughs> and we're yeah. fucking with me. No. <laughs> like, I don't like You're it. building, bro. I, I would literally okay. ban HOAs if I was legislator. Yeah, yeah, yeah this I, is I, interesting. I, you yeah. always talk about yeah, this. Yeah, like yeah. I, I would literally ban HOAs, and the only thing they would be allowed to do is process payments and collect funds. That's uh, there's it. Yeah. Uh, they're illegal in some states, correct? I think like Texas has like a lot of limitations on a HOAs. A lot of limitations. Um yeah, I don't know. I mean, like I said, like um, it should all they do all they should be able to do is is collect funds to be able to pay for repairs and shit like that. That's it. Yeah. But like, dude, they'll straight up tell you like you can't have people like do like less than three month rentals. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So like or you can't paint your house or like yeah you know, yeah you yeah can't yeah. put a flag up in your window. That's fine. Like, I'm just bro. trying to rock the Nazi flag. Exactly. Yeah. Like, yeah. Fuck off, bro. Yeah, man. Let me shine with my people. Freedom Why of Pride speech. World One, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I heard some shady shit go down with HOA. I was talking to a friend of mine. He's on an HOA. He's like, yeah, man, it's like, you got to get on it. And I was like, what? I don't want to get on HOA. And he's like, yeah, man. So it what? sounds some like he's talking about a drug. I know. <laughs> I was like, you, you have a choice? Board. My I know you get had a choice. Board. What? Oh, get on the board. Get on yeah. the board. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's choice. like cutthroat politics, like local politics. Yeah, so he's it's talking about his like- HOA. He's like, yeah, man, so what we do is like, we have a big old meeting with all the HOA people, and it's like, all right, we need to get the roofs fixed. Like, it's been 10 or 20 years. Uh, and then someone goes like, someone goes like, yo, I, I know a guy. And then they go to, like, their homie that owns a roofing business Sorry. and get a cut of yep. it. Some kickbacks. Some kickbacks. Illegal. Illegal as <laughs> fuck. Ooh, and, and my homie's like, yeah, dude, yeah. you should get on your HOA and do that. I'm like, bro, what? <laughs> No, man, I'll pay the $200 a month. Let me know. Shut up. I know some people. I don't know, though. Is that that illegal, though? Absolutely. I I feel like there's something weird going on there. That's 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 like the government contracts where they they, contract their homes. But it's not government. That's the thing. You don't think that there's some kind of fraud in there? No. Absolutely. You don't think so? No. I'm getting a cutback. Unless unless, unless it's like a highly regulated industry, which is probably not. Like I guarantee you it's perfectly legal. I don't the, the, know. This, this, there, there are there are so many there's so much shit in like real estate and construction that sounds like it should be illegal and it isn't. Yeah, maybe I don't know. 
I it, mean, he's a construction guy. <laughs> what are the, no, what are the laws? Just ask me. <laughs> <laughs> like, it, it might be unethical. Yeah, like, absolutely. I mean, you might be right. It just feels um, illegal. Like, if somebody asks me, yeah. if, like, should, should I do this? I'm like, mm, uh, talk to a lawyer. That seems yeah. not right. Seems a unless it's like, it's unless like, Scoops like, had four beers, it's like, like fucking do it. it. It's do like, it. It's, <laughs> like, <laughs> clack. it's like when you go somewhere where, like, drinking in public is legal. Yeah. And like for that first day you're drinking in public, you're like, yo, this doesn't seem right. <laughs> yeah, it never yeah, the first right. two hours of yeah. Vegas. It's yeah. Like, ah, yeah. Shit. yeah. It's like, man, <laughs> fuck this big ass can Fucking of white claw. Co- cops drive by and you're doing the whole like yeah. hide, hiding it down on your side. Like Hell yeah. Yeah. Let's go to Home Depot. That sounded fun. <laughs> it did. You Let's just see, go and just bullshit. A little power drill. You need some 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 uh some bits for that. The dude, yeah. the dude yeah, today some screwdrivers. <laughs> the guy today, the electrician that was over was like uh we were talking about AC. What was that? Yeah. <laughs> so we, we were talking about the, the like the ACs in the in the apartment and I had one that I haven't hooked up yet. And uh and he's like he's like, Oh, if you want, I can just do the casing and cut a hole in the wall to the outside. I'm like Bro, I can't just fuck yeah. it. <laughs> that shit. No, I mean there's like casings that you that you can put through the wall to the outside, but like that that shit goes right to the fucking street. Could you imagine my property manager driving by and uh, seeing a fucking uh, AC, AC unit sticking out the wall? <laughs> yeah, they would notice right away. Right well, away it would yeah. look so much different than the other ones. Just yeah, like, yeah, exactly. I mean, yeah. Yeah. if anything, it make the value go up because now you got an AC unit. Now they all need them though. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Why does he have one and yeah, I don't? Yeah, exactly. Go try to explain that to your landlord. Oh, yeah, absolutely. The place <laughs> probably gets fucking hot without an AC thing, huh? Bro, this is the first time I've seen officially behind, like, one of the exterior walls, like, the drywalls in my in my apartment, zero insulation. Yeah. That's Damn. all PV. They all, all they are a lot of San Diego. Yep. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, That's fucked up. Which it seems crazy. What seems were they doing crazy. back then? They just didn't, like, energy conservation, like, the expensive fucking, you know, electricity bills and shit like that wasn't a fucking thing. Yeah. So huh. like now, like we know, like in order to keep prices low, or keep you know you're spending low on that on that, on that kind of shit, you got to use insulation. But back then they were just like, you can survive, you can survive. There's <laughs> got to there's got to be a company that like cuts a little hole in your wall and can put like insulation up in there. Somehow. Yeah, they need a spray foam. Well, yeah, there's you spray foam. That? that shit's super expensive. Man, that's one of those videos that's just like satisfying. It looks like yeah, you yeah, watch it, 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 it looks like you eat it. It looks like you eat it. Like cotton candy. Cotton candy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, <that's> like, <laughs> Yeah, when nice. they spray it in the wall. There's a lot of shit like that. You watch it, you're like, damn, that's satisfying to watch. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Like peeling off the plastic like we were talking about. Yeah, yeah, everything on Pornhub, you know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, like, Low job what? ASMR. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, th- this last summer was hot as fuck in San Diego. We haven't had a summer like this in a while, right? Yeah, no, no. Dude, that, uh, it was like two months, and it was hot as hell. Oh, yeah. there, Especially see. where I'm at. It's like it's in the 90s. Cause, well, probably where you're at, too. Dude, but as I'm soon like as up you, on that cross the freeway. The only, thing, yeah. the only thing that I got going for me is the fucking breeze from the ocean. That's it. Yeah. Other have, than that, it's hot AC? as hell. Oh, we have AC. We uh, So I have solar, so the AC, um, I can run it, and it's like not too super expensive. Yeah. So I was like, all right, I'm going to test it out one month. This is during like the heat wave. I'm going to run it 24-7. Like. Keep it at like ah, oh, we keep it like 68, 69, 70. Ooh, you know? that's frosty. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know? <laughs> yeah. Get that good. You sleep. Oh, oh, I slept okay, so baller. <laughs> um, and it came out to uh, three hundred bucks for Damn. the whole month. For the whole month. That's yeah, so it's not bad. That's a, that's but that like, compared to what, what's your 20- baseline? Probably like one fifty, like two hundred. Oh, uh, fifty. Fifty, really? Yeah, dude. A, uh, fucking solar panels. Oh, okay. We have solar. Yeah, yeah, but without that, yeah. it would be. You can't yeah. use solar yeah. with uh, the AC. Well, it's just no, more you electricity. Okay. Yeah, but I'm saying like. It's it, it's cheap like that. It would be. I, I have friends that are paying like four hundred, five hundred dollars. Their homes are big and they don't have solar panel. So if I run it twenty four seven, it's only three hundred. But if I don't even have my AC on, like usually I don't. It's not that hot. Uh, it's fifty bucks that's a what, month. That's man. what's funny when people talk shit about. Like obviously California is expensive, but they're like, oh, it's so fucking expensive out there. It's like, yeah, you live in Phoenix and you pay a thousand dollars a month for your fucking. That's why I want to move, bro. For your electricity bill yeah. though, like, like yeah, like rent's cheaper, but you're still your your energy bills are fucking crazy. Like, yeah. yeah, I got a lot to go to Vegas, man, but it's just weirdos and it's hot out there. Vegas is fucking weird. Yeah, it's yeah. weird. Yeah, 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 it's weird. Yeah, it's just weird. Like you have to be weird to like want to move out there. I'm going there because the housing is cheaper. Well, yeah. yeah. But it's just like if that place is open and collapse though all, at all times. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like if there's a recession or anything, you know, like all those casinos dry up, like you know, people stop going what there. What are you yeah. talking about though? You think that'll happen? It already did. It's never happened. Yeah. Oh, so, oh I thought you didn't realize you got the fuck with me. <laughs> what? No, no, no. Oh. When did it happen? 
Uh, in 2008? Yeah, yeah the, that was like the worst. No, that, was, that, that was the first That was the first recession, depression, where people actually um, slowed down their alcohol intake. Dude, oh, Vegas dude, was that bad? Ve- like you couldn't live there? In Vegas, they like could not sell a home. It was crazy. It was like oh, fire okay. sell. Yeah, like yeah, all those, you know, like Henderson, that whole area. Mm-hmm. Like, nobody, Everybody's fleeing there because there's no fucking jobs. They, yeah, oh, wow, I didn't know that. Basically, if you didn't live in like an urban core, like an urban center, like you were fucked. There were towns like, uh, like you know, Patterson, like like way outside of the Bay Area. It's like the very edges. Yeah. Um, that play that that they were people were just walking away from their homes. Like entire neighborhoods just gone. Holy shit! You couldn't even fucking sell the homes. Damn. Mm-hmm. I I didn't know that. I didn't know it was that like serious yeah. out there. You ever seen that? What was the Big Short? I think it's Big Short. That's yeah. a great movie. That was a great movie. Yeah. Oh, you've already seen it. So then you should know about the housing shit. <laughs> yeah, I gotta take you to Home Depot <laughs> and the movie theater. Hey, we're going to installation, some wood. Scoot's going to take us to fucking Home Depot like he's our dad, bro. Yeah, yeah. Hey, let's buy, this, let's buy my son a toolkit. Oh, yeah, I'm going to get you a little toolbox, and then I'm just going to fill it up. Like, oh, that's good. That's <laughs> that, good. That, 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 I, what's the Ikea ones? The shitty yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, those are dope. I got yeah. a couple of those, that's man. Works. They're dope for hanging pictures, all right? It works. It works. But I also have a jigsaw, so watch out. And you're going to need a rubber mallet. Tony, <laughs> just like adding him shit. That's a problem if you if you have, if you have like no storage, like every tool that you get is just like adding more to your fucking. Bro, head. you guys gotta check out my uh, my workbench I bought. I bought it at a uh, home, oh, that's, home Depot. That's why you want to have like people Husky come over for your birthday. Shit. Yeah, well, you guys should come. Uh, you've been you haven't been to one of my birthdays at my house, no. but it, it's fun, man. We got the ping pong table out there. We got a couple like backyard. You know that little. Uh, that little ring on a on a string, and you like let it go. Oh, yeah, it yeah, goes yeah. to the wall and like hooks on. We got that. It's cool. But yeah, my tool my toolbox is fucking my tool station. Sick. We'll check it out. On your birthday, <laughs> you right? seen we'll it? Yeah, we'll, we'll maybe you didn't out, see man. it. But are we, we going to sit out there like king of the fucking hill? Yeah, just like, like, <laughs> drink a beer, just admire his fucking. Tool. It's way cooler than that, bro. Just we got bitches, right? bro. Man, we've come a long way since the old studio in Mission Valley. <laughs> <laughs> Some Jesus old man God. shit. Yeah, oh man. <laughs> no, man, it's cool. It's cool, dude. I got the epoxy on the ground, man. That's cool. We're going to be Big doing cocaine shit. off it, right? <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's clean as fuck, man. <laughs> Garage floor is clean. Did that old man shit is uh, when you at when there's a guy like barbecuing. He's like, oh, how do you like your burger? But they all come the same. Yeah, exactly. yeah. <laughs> that's like that's dad shit right there. Oh yeah, you, medium. Yeah, yeah for yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. Shut the fuck up. It is, dude. You especially what you get. Especially when you get a home. Like you have people over and like you have like like minded people over and they're like, oh, this is nice. Like this is a nice kitchen counter. Like what? Oh no, it came with a home. Yeah, yeah, cool, cool. How'd you mount your TV? Oh no, you know, like oh, cool. damn. We old, we're old, <laughs> we're old. We're What's well, all bullshit small talk? That's why. Yeah, yeah, true. <laughs> we're true, trying to make true. conversation, bro. Yeah, true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know I mean? yeah, none of my friends that come over. We're not even real friends. It's yeah. just small talk all night until the drugs come out. Uh, oh yeah, that is the worst though. The small talk when yeah. if you don't really know somebody and it's legitimate small talk and you're like, oh, or that, people or, are like, or that out person you see like once every six months or some shit like that. Yeah, yeah. 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 There's a lot of yeah. there's a lot of small talk in the DJ booth. Uh, it's all <laughs> small talk. It's just all. You know who's really good at. At, at small talk, Chris Cuts, bro. Yeah, because like he's, yeah, he's like not good, but like good in a bad way. Like I love the dude, but it's like, hey man, what have you been up to? Oh, the same shit. Like the DJs, we have the same exact conversations every time we see each other. Yeah. Where you at after this? Where'd you play it last yeah. night? Where you at last? You fucking, <laughs> oh, you got fucked up last night. Yeah, man. Uh, yeah, yeah, cool, man. So where are you playing new places? Like. Dude, fuck. Shit. You hear the new TS touch? Ah, literally, man, literally but it's the same places for the last seven years. <laughs> yes, <laughs> exactly. Bro, you hear about that new you, spot yeah, opening up? You, you yeah. still a typhoon? Oh no, it closed down. Never mind. <laughs> uh, I was telling my girlfriend this other night. Like sometimes we go out, and she's like, "We we don't go out and like hang out with other people. Sometimes maybe like once a month, you know." I was like, "We don't have like a lot of friends other than just like us." But if we all go out, it's like we're getting fucked up. But I told her, I was like, I just hate small talk. Like, and then we have to say the same fucking shit. Like, hey, Shorty, what have you been up to, man? Ah, like, oh, really? I haven't been DJing much. Just on oh, Twitch, my ears, you know. Oh, yeah, yeah, same fucking shit over and over. And we just got out of, like, the pandemic talk. Like, <laughs> <laughs> and people still bring it up, too. Uh, what? Man, it still comes up sometimes. Like, oh, I don't yeah. want to talk about this anymore. I don't want to. Like, oh, yeah. I, was, I mean, I'm, it was a rough times, man. Was, I know, but it's just like. I, I love the fact that, like, we talk about it in the past, like, it was some, like, distant thing that happened it like, is. years ago. It well, is. Well, no, distant. no. That I mean, was like, decades for me. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. <laughs> I was a kid. Saying, no. That's what I'm saying. We talk about it like it was like, oh, back then. Like, yeah, yeah, <laughs> we're trying to bury that shit, dude. I fucking. Uh, some people, that's their personality, and they can't get rid of it. Like, Absolutely. Just, just putting the pandemic. Cr- COVID, put it in the conversation. It's like, bro, stop. I was on the phone with my buddy uh, from the Bay Area, and uh, he brought up how many cases were in L.A., and I was like, what? This is like two weeks ago. Whoa. I was like, bah, 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 bah. 
I don't give a fuck. Whoa. <laughs> Let them all die. I don't give Damn. a fuck. Wow. Yeah, ruthless. Is, is it still popping like that? I don't know. I'm Me not either. looking. If you, yeah, exactly. If you're care. looking and you're looking for anything, anything's popping, bro. Like you in LA, the crime in LA, it's popping. That's what I was talking you're about. Looking. The security cameras. You're looking at the security yeah, cameras. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. It's all full circle. Ignorance is bliss. And we just haven't heard of it. I heard about the numbers of COVID because I think, you know, everyone just, we're not Listen paying this attention. Guy, he's sounding like me now. <laughs> no, God, no. Like, I'm going to start texting Alice. Hey, bro, did you see this? Send him news links. Did you see this, bro? Kanye talking shit about the Jews. <laughs> Let's get him. I still haven't caught it. That's that's cool. Damn. Yeah. Really? Yeah. No shit, man. You might you might be one of like the few people that's. Uh, that's what are we doing to it? What are we? Why? Why? <laughs> we why were we just this? talking. About why are we doing? This? Oh, I love that. I'm just saying. Why are we? <laughs> why? All right, cool. <laughs> like subject. Hey, so check this out. Um, I was uh, I was on I was on the way to one of my gigs in PB, and I was in the back alley, and there was this guy in this like Volkswagen van that was parked on the side, and there was a apartment uh, on the other side with the garage door open. They were moving shit, right? They are moving shit. I was pulling up. I couldn't get through because there wasn't enough room. And I noticed there was a, there was a guy in a big-ass truck behind him trying to get through as well. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm chilling there waiting. And then freaking uh, the guy uh, that was moving shit, he runs to his, his van. So it looked like he was about yeah. to move it. So as he's running to his van, the guy in the back just got fed up. He's like, fuck it. I'm going through this shit. So he starts to go through, and it looked like it, he cleared the van, yeah. but he didn't realize the side mirrors. The side mirrors were sticking out. He just, pow, hit that shit. And the dude, like, he sees it. He's like, what the fuck? They fucking start you know, say, yelling and shit. Yeah. A little bit. Like, you just see the, the altercation just escalate. Yeah, escalate. Escalate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. escalate. This is on your story, and, right? And Dom, yeah, but, yeah, yeah, Dom but, got his phone out. <laughs> no, I, I put it away. After that. I was like, ah, I don't want to get shot, man. Just, I'll, just, <laughs> I'll put this away. But, uh, yeah, as you see it escalate and escalate to the point where the dude was like, man, how about I just pull you out of the car and beat your ass, you fucking faggot? And Ooh. dude was like, to the uh, old man. Yeah. And the old man's like, motherfucker, what you with? Ah, they start going back and forth. So the dude uh, in the truck is starting to pull off. He wants to speed off. Yeah. But, like, I'm in the alley, too, so he doesn't want to speed off and, like, hit an interstate bystanding yeah. DJ like myself. You know what I mean? <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to go to work, man. He sees I'm a working man. He saw the he backpack. See, hey. He saw the backpack. <laughs> he saw the bumper sticker. I'd rather be DJing. He saw it. He saw it. <laughs> So yeah, he's pulling off. As he's pulling off, he's dragging this dude's mirror by the eye point. He's fucking dragging it, and the dude and his friend they get uh, they uh, get to the side of this dude's truck, and they start punching and kicking it. Oh, and the fuck. dude trying to like pull off, and he's pulling off. But you know what I mean? He's trying to squeeze by me too. And I'm just sitting here watching. He ends up pulling off. Skating out of there, freaking all the neighbors like come out and shit. Yeah. And it was funny, man. Like the car pulls off, the uh, dudes are yelling. The neighbors come out. I'm sitting there. Who the neighbors look at? They're looking at you. To yeah. Me. Yeah. 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 You, you gotta get out of there. You get shot by the cops. The black guy in the BMW. I was just like, oh, I was like, bro, I'm trying to get knocked out. No, don't look at me. Him, bro. Him. They're like, oh, you know what I'm saying? The yeah, dude's like yeah. getting their van and they fucking chase after him. And then fucking I'd park my I car and go to chase you. Would you chase? I'm not chasing. What are you? What, yeah, like what? Are you, like what, what are you gonna accomplish? What, what, yeah, what are you? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm getting, what are you gonna I'm do getting, once you catch up? Picture yeah. of their license plate and then fucking that's it. Yeah, and then just fucking call the cops. Like you don't know that. who you're chasing. Yep, that dude might be absolutely out he, of his mind. He looked like a Turlock White Pride Worldwide kind of guy <laughs> for sure. He did. He looked like he had a shotgun. <laughs> fucking yeah. for sure. He's gonna be at Shoney's birthday. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, Tom's like, hey, yo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't say anything. I got away. Um, same kind of situation happened to me. Not really, but I was at uh, this restaurant getting some pho for like lunch, and there was this uh, young, a gentleman that was probably gay at the front desk that was just like you know people like hey sit over here like the the waiter or whatever and, and uh, what. Stunning and brave. Stunning and brave. Stunning and and brave. Uh, he's a super nice kid, and he sat me at my table, and then some dude came in and was like. Being like kind of aggressive, like to talk, like talking like aggressively to him, and like, oh, "Where's your manager?" And the manager comes out. I don't know what was going on, but then I just started hearing words like, you know, like, "Oh yeah, you're probably a little fat. You probably like it in the ass." Blah blah. What like, the <laughs> fuck, bro? Who's and I'm like, like "What the fuck?" I'm just trying to eat lunch, homie. Like, and I look over. I'm like a, I'm like a table away, and then he starts fucking, and he starts like, not like going towards him, but just like putting his hands on the table, like getting closer. And I'm yeah. like, "Oh fuck." And I, the guy can't see me, and I'm sitting there, and, dude, homeboy behind the desk is just like, bro, what's going on? Like, he doesn't look like a fighter, and I'm just like, it's totally unfair, man. So what you about to do? Shoney's put his, <laughs> Shoney's put his <laughs> fucking <laughs> shot in this bitch. Shoney's just putting his gi on. Like, <laughs> all right, Shoney. You start fucking 
Dip it in that Kool Aid on other flavor, man. So I I say it's it's <laughs> and I'm sitting there, and I'm like, I th- I'm thinking, I'm thinking, and I'm like, man, this is fucked up. Like, I want to stand up for this fucking dude because this guy's, I don't know what's going on. And then I start thinking, like, maybe they got like prior beef. You know what I'm saying? And they ended up, they ended up having prior beef. I talked to the kid after the guy left. But then on the other side of my head, I was like, yeah, like I don't know the dude. The dude looks sketch. We're in Chula Vista, and what if I get up and I'm just like, "Hey, man, what the fuck's your problem?" Yeah. <laughs> you, yep, you can, die, I you, can die, you can die a hero. Exactly, <laughs> man. So it's just like same situation like with you, like that oh, guy. I like, what, I you know, not you, but the yeah. other guy. Like, like when do you stand up? Because like it could be, you know, it's, it's, kind of, yeah. it's kind of a weird thing. Like I, whenever like there's a video of somebody like going crazy on like a subway or like a train or something like that, everybody in the comments like, "Why isn't anybody doing anything?" It's like. Like, dude, if you live in a city, you know, like, some of these dudes just wild out a little, and, like, and you don't want to escalate it. Like, yeah, especially yeah, yeah. if they kind of, like, look normal, and they got clothes on, and, like, they're not, go- they're not like, crazy wild, like, running around in their underwear like homeless people. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But it's like, yeah, it, it, this could be it. So where's the line? Like, you walk in, you go somewhere, you, like, walk by a car, and there's some dude beating the shit out of his girlfriend, like, call the police. Oh, I'm not getting involved in any domestic. Call the police. Uh, other stuff That's I might get involved That's definitely where you get shot. Yeah, I'm not getting involved. I don't get Hey, it. fool, quit hitting pop. Like, the- yeah, exactly. Exactly. Maybe, maybe if it looks like he's about to kill her, like legitimately, yeah. like he's stomping her head in and she's already knocked out or something. Maybe, but even then, I'm not even sure if it's worth it. Uh, like straight up, you don't have she, no she idea. She might already be dead. And maybe it was her fault. Yeah, maybe she got caught cheap though. <laughs> oh, definitely not getting monetized on this. One. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Hey man, that's like this video I saw. This uh, this dude with his shirt off, he's walling out at Burger King. Fuck, he look good. Hey. Was he like hot? No, he was just like he was just kind of crazy. Oh, crazy yeah. hot! No, motherfucker. <laughs> okay. Had some crazy dick. Yeah, because you see the imprint. Anyways, okay. like he hops the counter, starts fucking with the, uh, the cashier, starts fucking with the people in the back, and this dude comes in. He's like, "Yo, man, chill the fuck out, brother. Just trying to do their job." He's like, "Why don't you come on?" He's like, you, "You think you're all tough? Why don't you hop that corner and come do that shit to me?" And the dude's like, "What?" And he, dude hopped the corner, and he beat the shit out that guy. <laughs> <laughs> All our videos. That dude uh, got his fucking ass whooped for trying to be You guys see the video of the Marine. They have two dudes come in. One of them has a gun. It's like in 7 Eleven. And the Marine like has his back to him. And then they come in and the Marine looks over, waits till he the guy with the gun walks by him, and then he ends up attacking him and like getting the gun away. Like, would you do that? I've seen, I've seen if that. you're if you're in 7 Eleven, you're walking out, and there's a dude walking in with a gun. Are you just you just I'm walking out. Yes. Well, I'm, out the, right. I'm out the I'm, door. Now, right. now I'm not part of the fucking robbery. I'm telling you right. I'm going to my car. I'm, I'm leaving. I'm just asking. This is coming from a person who carries a gun. I'm walking out. <laughs> I've seen it in your fucking pants well, right now. Well, not right now. I'm, I'm having oh, a beer. Dick? That's, that's just, just a dick. dick. <laughs> that's just dick, baby. That's just dick, baby. That's Actually, oh. not dick. That's all that, balls. That, that's, just, <laughs> <laughs> that's just his cock nine. <laughs> cock nine. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I, I've thought, I mean, you, like when I got the license years ago, I re- you know you know you need to have some serious conversation with yourself. Like, am I actually going to pull this out? Am I actually going to shoot somebody? Well, if you pull it out, you're you have to. If use you pull it, it out, you have you're, to, you're, yeah, you're using it's it. It's yeah. time to use it. Yeah, but you have to have these serious convos. And I, I made up my mind way back then. I was like, hey, this is life or fucking death, and only my life. Maybe even if there was like a like a sh- like a mass shooting going, I don't even think I'm. You getting might out of you there. might blast the wrong person. We well, right right or or, or <laughs> well, they might think it's you. Or they think yeah, it's me. Yeah, or, yeah, but maybe there's another dude who has a gun and he thinks he's yep, protecting everyone yeah, yeah. else and then he shoots me. That's my uh, argument for people in Texas that are like Texas is safer because we all have guns and it's like. Okay, so if there's a mass shooting at a mall and then all these Texans start pulling out their guns. Exactly. Who's right. shooting who now? <laughs> like, what the fuck? Well, I mean, we all know the Wild West was safe because of their high guns. <laughs> numbers. Right? Oh, those fools were wasted. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> they all had syphilis or fucking completely wasted. Don't blame it on the guns. <laughs> oh, syphilis. You oh. ride a horse for 19 days straight. You got syphilis, no water. You're going to be shooting people too. Yeah, I'd be yeah. pretty pissed oh, off. 2020, what a year. <laughs> Um, yeah, man, I just, I, you know what I think it is for me and I'm starting to come to terms just like you are is, uh, seeing those videos, they look very, uh, heroic, you know, like, damn, that, that would have been me. But then I'm, I'm just eating a meal and some, some gay dudes getting harassed. I'm like, Oh, should I do it? But it's, it's my true. time to shine. Is it my time to die? You yeah, know? Exactly. Cause literally you don't know where that's going. It, you, you don't, don't. Yeah, you don't, I, I don't Maybe that guy be. has three dudes outside. And maybe like, he wants to kill someone today. Maybe. He's like, I, I'm going to kill it. this dude. And then I pop up. He's like, Oh, I'm going to kill this dude. Yeah. Too. I wish a motherfucker would. <laughs> You're like, Oh shit. <laughs> hey, speaking of killing people. Oh, Whoa. Oh shit! 
You ain't killed nobody boxing. I didn't kill nobody, but I looked goofy as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what, man. I t- I'm on my second my second uh, class of boxing. I look like a drunk giraffe, bro, <laughs> with boxing gloves on. I it's fucking it's hilarious, but I love it. Like it's a cardio workout. It's a cardio it? workout, and yeah, it's, it's like I, my mind is working. Like it was working when I was a white belt when I first started jujitsu. Like yeah. my eyes are not leaving the fucking instructor, like the teacher. I I need to look because I have no clue what's going on. Crazy yeah. hot, huh? <laughs> Dude, the muscles, the veins. Um, yeah, you, you know how it was when you first yeah, started yeah. jujitsu, and you're just like you have to pay attention because you have no fucking yeah, clue. You what's get going lost on. so quick. Yeah. You get lost so quick. Yeah. And now, and now, I, second class of boxing, I'm like. Holy shit! I'm watching the instructor, and then like we go to spar, and I have no fucking clue. What when I'm they doing. do those combos, have you ever been to a yeah, class? Yeah, yeah, those combos, yeah. and they're like one, two, three, you know, uppercut, like jab, uppercut, jab. jab, 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 duck under, you know, hook. And you're like, oh fuck! And it just keeps getting deeper and yep. deeper, and now it's eight punches in. Yep. My bro, I can't, I can't even do that. I can't even do that shit on PlayStation. <laughs> <laughs> For yeah, man, it's though, it's yeah. gnarly, dude. But yeah. it's like it's really fun, and like Dom said, it's a good cardio workout. Are you gonna come back to boxing? I know you did it for a while, right? A little bit. Yeah, yeah. come through. It's it's a good balance between jujitsu and boxing. It's a great balance. Shoney's just preparing himself so he can be the hero. I know. Shoney prepared <laughs> to be the hero. For what? No, no, man. Like I just it, it's ever since he started jujitsu, now he's st- when people stare, he stares back. No. <laughs> when there's an I altercation, did. now he's ready to I think did. about stepping in. <laughs> on, on, that caught the eye, Shorty. Don't get shot out here, I bro. I just hope it's all black belts get their ass whooped, On man. his headphones, uh, I can be your hero, baby. <laughs> Enrique Iglesias. I, I bet those, those hero situations, though, they just happen, like, not even on purpose. You know what I mean? It's not like the per- the person's like, oh, you know, the, you know, I'm doing this. It's just like, oh, you're thrust into it. Bam, that's, it just happens. Yeah. You're not like... Yeah, I don't know because it's just too too scary. It's kind of weird because really? like a lot of people who like think they're gonna be the hero and are super like braggadocio about it are bitching out. Hundred percent. And the dude who would never think of himself as a hero is like jumping in out of instinct. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Yeah, yeah. I yeah, do like instinct. Jesus and turn the other cheek. <laughs> so like I didn't see shit. <laughs> Not my problem. Like Spider Man. The first time. <laughs> like oh switchblade. Like, yeah. I'm like Jesus, baby. <laughs> I, I miss I miss the part where that's my problem. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking at the gay dude. I'm like, hey, should have been gay. Peace. <laughs> Please. <laughs> sounds, like, time. sounds like you were fucking the wrong dude. I don't know. <laughs> Did you fuck yeah. his cousin? What the fuck's going on here, bro? <laughs> Their histories they dated. Oh, probably. They, dude, they did have that, history, that's, so. That's some yeah. common shit, dude. Dude was yeah. on the DL, married yeah, with a family. Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> they, in the gay community, that happens a lot, man. Like, straight dudes be hooking up with gay dudes, and then they get mad, and they fucking beat them up and shit. Yeah. It's bad. It's terrible. Could- could you imagine that secret if you're married? It's one thing to cheat, but it's another thing to cheat with a dude. Go all the way. My, Go out, my, baby. I'm my, just... my good friend, when a good friend growing up uh, grew up across the street from me, like his dad, or his parents got divorced, and then his dad came out like, shit, I may have been like already in my 30s when that happened. And yeah, the whole they had four kids, um, just normal, typical suburban family, and that dude had that secret for Fucking forever, God. bro. That's the that's the plot to American Beauty, homie. <laughs> Jesus, Dude, Dude, that's just, wild though. He's yeah. just taking wild back job. shots of the yeah, fucking. That's, that's so. <laughs> the what, what's funny? What's, what's, <laughs> what's funny? Don't what's come funny on my scenes. <laughs> my child sits there. <laughs> my 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 dad. My dad was super suspicious of him, like even before. Like I guess like he kind of like made like a a slight pass at my dad at one point. Yeah, yeah that a quick like See, no, that, that's accidental stupid. hand rub. Like, like, yeah, no, no, yeah, yeah. It, was, it was like a sort of like a little like when you're um what what's it called like when you're cruising kind of thing you know what yeah, I mean yeah, yeah. like give like a quick look or like a little you know yeah, it was like yeah, one yeah. of those kind of deals kind of I had that one of my <laughs> one of my homies in high school he's fucking married with kids now and uh, just one time like I was a driver I was like the DD and he he was getting fucked up he was hell fucking faded and I was driving him home and he like made a pass on me like put his hand on my thigh and i was like oh he's drunk like he's probably like, hey thanks man i appreciate it and then his, his hand started going a little higher a little higher and i was like what like, oh, the fuck no what bro the fuck? yeah he was straight as a fucking two by four bro and i was like what the fuck never never nothing else after that like i don't even know if he remembers like he has a family with kids who knows maybe he's getting his back blown out by fucking <laughs> joe schmo <laughs> But damn, I did not have any of that. I was like, "Yo, what the fuck?" Oh, like, I was I surprised. Mean, you you got to imagine, like, I was like, "Hand, hey, no mouth." It's, it's way- <laughs> <laughs> I'm not down Do for that dry. Right. I'm not down for that dry hobo yeah, jerk down. Come on, on bro. Bro. dude, slobber that knob, <laughs> <laughs> At least a little moisture. You come on, have some slobber that knob, Kevin. <laughs> Kevin. S's. 
<laughs> but you got you got to imagine like like it's way more socially acceptable to be bisexual if you're a woman. So you got to imagine yeah. there's probably way more fucking bisexual dudes out there than you, ever admitted. used to be. I feel like in this next generation coming up, it's like it's, it's the, normal. The, the, the playing almost. field is open. Yeah, it's gonna be fifty Literally. fifty. I, th- I think so. Yeah, yeah. I, For yeah. Sure. yeah. I was talking to someone the other day at Victory <laughs> in the sauna. They were talking about how. Uh, how they were walking around in the Pacific Beach, and they've been around a, a long time, and they were like, "Yeah, dude, you see a bunch of like gay couples all the time, that and that weird. wasn't normal." <laughs> <laughs> and that's nor it's normal. It wasn't like that, no, you know, no, back in the early two thousands no. at all. And I and I told them I was like, "Yeah, dude, when I DJ like nightclubs, there's gay couples all the time. Two yeah. dudes kissing on the dance floor, no one fucking cares. We shouldn't. It's fucking normal now. That's cool. That, like back in the day, like that might have got you gay bash. Like maybe not in the club, but like somebody would have like followed you out. There would, yeah, there would have been a couple people that said something, but for the most part uh, people would stare for sure yeah but uh yeah now it's like it happens all the time that's Dude, cool uh, there's these two chicks at mavericks and they were going at hey, it talk slow talk slow <laughs> on the couch like laying on Dude, each other that's not no, real lesbianism though <laughs> bro sh- sh- let the man finish it got so let bad. me put my headphones on hold on it got so bad security got upset so bad it was so like good. <laughs> stop that shit right now before we kick you out were they tell, like, us, like, tell us more were, you know, were they like grinding like that kind of like yeah bro like they was what, bro, were, you, what were you playing Fuck it, uh, genuine <laughs> pony. Well, there you go. That was your fault. That was your fault. You did. Hey, good yeah, job, Dom. We, that's we, a DJ, yeah, right? That's a true DJ. When right you play there. pony, that's that's on the DJ. <laughs> I'm nobody, grinding nobody. my homie, <laughs> Kevin. Hey, come here. <laughs> Kevin. Our song's on. <laughs> Chicks love it when dudes kiss and bump stuff. Come yeah. on. Wait, do, do you think it was uh, like the 20 year old college girls looking for attention, or like both? Both. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah, yeah. they they were younger, and or they what? Were like roommates, or what? Or, or like actually doing some. You know how like lesbians ain't hanging out at math. Rick's and PB. Well, okay, I'm, I'm just saying. I'm, you know how like those, bisexuals. Are, yeah. Like, bisexuals are you, for sure. If you're like that kind of person, like there's probably a decent chance you could swing a threesome out of Mavericks at some yes, point. Yeah, you could swing a threesome anywhere. Well, well try it right now. <laughs> <laughs> Let's no, fucking go. Try, try, it, try it right now. Let's go. I got Kevin on the phone right now. Let's go family style on Dom. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> So I don't get a turn. Just, <laughs> Damn, it must be Friday night, bro. This shit is getting wild up at the TTGF. Woo! <laughs> so I don't get a turn. That was his fucking. That was his concern. God damn. <laughs> Shit, bro. <laughs> Family style on Dom. <laughs> That's gonna be the header of the episode, bro. That's gonna be the teaser. Oh my god. No, is that, is that gay? I don't know. Nah, not I don't even know what family like, style I is. Just, I just remember being like 18 to like 23, and you know, you meet girls in that say, same area, and they're like making out, just looking for attention. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just, You ain't about that. I mean, it was, it was hot. Oh, for sure. For sure. Yeah, for sure. Was like, Dom was up in the DJ booth. <laughs> I mean, yeah. they're beat up. <laughs> you got the camera out. Fucking one hand on the computer, other hand on my hey, dick. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Dom's like, yo, 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 this one goes out to my ladies. It's genuine. Yeah. <laughs> This dude's like Steven Spielberg out there getting the rig set up. He's got the tripod and the floodlight. He's got the full shoulder cam. <laughs> the Home Alone fucking. The steady rig. He's <laughs> it was nice, though. I was like, this yeah, really going it, at it. that's always a nice surprise for a DJ. Bro. When, you know, the dance floor, and then you just see a couple, like, you know, a couple chicks just going, out. okay. And they, they don't stop. You're yeah, like, yeah, okay, yeah. all right. The molly kicked in. Back in the day, like, when you were talking about, when you were, like, 18 to, like, 21, that was, like, the sign of a good party was when, like, two chicks started making out. In the yeah. Yeah. I mean, which is cool, but, like, that's not a sign of a good party. No. no. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> like, that it's kind of like, annoying. I'm like, oh, hey, there's yeah. 20 Let's dudes. Do. There's two chicks making out. Alex is like, hey. Yeah, 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 yeah. I see you, Shoney. Or, Happy or, birthday. Or the, other, or the other one was, like, dancing on, like, countertops and shit. Yeah, and now yeah. I'm older, and I'm like, that's just unsafe. Yes. Yeah, that, that, <laughs> well, what I always say, as a DJ, I'm like, there's always that the time in the night as a DJ needs it. We need to turn it on. It's like, all right, now I need to start going to the bangers, the folders where like the party just starts. Because sometimes, you know, if you do a full night, ten to close, it's like the dance floor is building up. But I, if I see a titty pop out, it's like, all right, I gotta, I gotta get it going yeah. a little bit. That means someone's drunk enough that their titty fell out. Yeah, and you didn't. That, okay, yeah. yeah, I like that rule. It's like, all right, cool. That <laughs> chick's kissing. That means like, yeah. all right, we even if it's ten thirty and it's dudes packed, grinding each other. Dude, fucking, I see a dick on the dance floor, <laughs> bro. But I'm you, 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 you see Kevin jiggling that dick. You're fucking <laughs> Kevin, not on me, but on them. Yes, Kevin. But then to, to your point too, though, that usually people are like kind of in the same vibe. 
So yeah. like if she feels comfortable pulling a titty out, that means everyone else is also probably pretty yeah. drunk. Yeah. All, like it, all it does thing. is it's like a, it's like a domino effect. Yeah. Like once one girl does something, then it's like yes. Yeah. Uh, if a drink gets yeah. spilled or someone's like slips into the DJ booth past like security, all those things for me are like little green flags. Like okay, it's yeah. the party is like it's just like ready. when you go out with your friends though, and then one person goes to like the next. And then you're like, oh, okay, I'll match that. And then you maybe you go to the one that, like, it's like, oh, uh, we, we, we partying we, like that? And then like, party, yeah, 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 then it's like, oh shit, we're getting out of it. <laughs> Everybody's getting crazy. I Woo! feel like Kevin's I feel, there. I Kevin's feel, there, <laughs> slobbing on knobs. <laughs> <laughs> you guys, you want me to invite Kevin to my birthday? Yeah, yeah, Dom, is Kevin. that what you're trying to say? Invite Kevin, man. He sounds like a good guy. <laughs> uh, I feel like that happens in Palm Springs when we go out to Palm Springs. Sometimes yeah, it's absolutely. like because there's no rules in Palm Springs, yep. and it's like we're at the pool and it's fucking dinner time, and someone like brings a shot, a round of shots the pool and it's usually scooped it's like oh oh okay are right, we doing right. this okay <laughs> the sun's still up we're doing this I you like know it. Those well, if one is good ten is better that's true dudes yeah oh okay <laughs> pretty much hey man Stunning TTG and we are all about equal equality hey how come you didn't want to go to Palm Springs this year for your birthday I'm over it yeah or just this year you're over it uh this year uh, for my 40th, my girlfriend's like, we got to go to Palm Springs. She loves Palm Springs. I don't know. I just wanted to fucking hang out in San Diego and just fucking chill, save a little bit of money, you know? Yeah. Not that I spend a lot of money when we go to Palm Springs because we get the Airbnb and shit, but I don't know. I feel Fuck like Airbnb. I'm it was not. That it one gets was a little nice. old. Are we, we going to go down that rabbit hole again? No, 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 no the, the one we had was that. nice. Oh. The one we had was nice because they said the one, the Airbnb that we wanted was for like 14 people and we had, a, we had 14 people coming. And they said, and, and we looked at the rooms, and we're like, is there enough rooms? And they're like, no, we're doing construction. We're adding two or three rooms on. They'll be done by the time you guys get there. Oh, wow. Cool. We show up, the rooms, <laughs> construction. Scoops over there with a hammer. <laughs> and a box, a box a Home Depot apron, the orange one, everything. Like, Don't worry, guys, I'm making a bigger room. Yeah. No, but for real, it was all construction. And we're like, oh, fuck. And so we, we fucking text the lady. She She's very nice, shows up with her kid. Like, And I was like, damn, okay. And she's like, oh, we totally forgot. <laughs> like, well, fuck. So they're like, we have another property that holds like fucking what 20 people had like a separate fucking like a Havana basketball room, court yeah a basketball fucking, court jacuzzi oh Cabana, dude, everything fucking, yeah, yeah, yeah fire plate oh yeah it was so awesome. she was like Fuck. you guys sleep here tonight and we'll give you two nights uh not free, but two nights yeah. at this bigger one that was more expensive. We'll give it to you for free. All right, fuck it. Cool. So uh, we got a couple friends to sleep on the couch. Some people shared a bed. I'm not sure what happened. Kevin um, and another Kevin. man. Kevin and Dom took nah, the guest nah, room. Come on. <laughs> Dom woke up all Do nervous. Do turn? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> so we did that. We all slept in there. And then so uh, Dom came the first night or second night, whatever. Yeah, but, uh, yeah, the main compound was sick. Yeah, she was dope. But. So now this year, it's like, we, I don't think we all want to pay that much money because I looked into it. It was expensive. But, yeah, a fucking basketball court, bro. It was, it was sick. Cool. But uh, I think we're just going to gonna stay in San Diego. More people will show up to my place and hang out. Like, I don't think Alex would ever come out to Palm Springs. Yeah. I invited you a couple times. You didn't uh, come out. I mean, you can't walk there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm Jewish, man. I can't go out there till I retire. <laughs> Dude, major retirement spot out there. But uh, yeah, so yeah. I just let's just stay in San Diego and get Ooh. fucked up, man. Yeah. You took the night off, right? I did. Good. Yeah, mix did. it up. Mix it up. Exactly. Uh. Mix it up. No, I, I don't go out there because I might accidentally run into family. That's not a joke. <laughs> really? Do you have a lot of family out there? Um, I do have some uh, snowbird family that goes out there from New York. Snowbird? What's is that a snowbird? slang for something? Yeah. Snowbird is like uh, is uh, somebody who um, in like the Northeast or the Midwest when it's super cold in the winter, they go somewhere warm and stay for most of that time period. Oh, am I supposed to be doing that? Oh, fucking snowbird. snowbird. No, but that's... Oh, where, did she, where did your sister live? The Midwest. Okay, yeah, yeah. She's yeah, a snowbird, fucking yeah. snowbird. Yeah, it's like deal Florida with that fucking cold. Yeah, that sounds that's like that's where you fucking want to live. Shit. Deal with it. <laughs> He's fucking no, that's, that's snowbirds, that's a snow, bro. That's a snow bunny. <laughs> oh my god, that's too close. All right, how, 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 uh, you know how are we doing on time, Dom? <laughs> uh, we're at an hour, but I did want to talk about <gasps> the janitor that got caught dipping his dick in a bottle of a chick's bottle of water, and she ended up getting an STD. What? That's, that's cool. That's <laughs> what? 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 <laughs> Say what? He dipped his dick yeah, man. in someone's... Yeah, Luis Diaz, age 50, has been charged with indecent assault and aggravated assault with a deadly is, is weapon. There, is there a decent assault? <laughs> hey, that's a, that's a compliment right there with a deadly weapon. Yeah, with a deadly Shit. weapon is dick. Both charges are related Damn. to the same victim. <laughs> 
Bro, what do you think I'm doing at Victory when you guys yeah. are on the mat and I just get there? I'm di- I'm dipping my dick in everything. He's on camera. Uh, he's ooh, cleaning the ooh, office. Ooh, 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 ooh. In can, this can I can I hear the whole story? Yeah. Sorry, <laughs> you bad. guys just... shut the fuck <laughs> yeah, up. Bro. Let the man finish his story. So he got caught on camera going to this chick's office and uh, dipping his dick in her, in her water. Yeah, bottle. we heard that one already. You like what? I'm just, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to piss you guys off now. I'm sorry. You're not Go pissing ahead, me dog. off. I don't, I don't I give a But yeah, like you say, like does it like put some water on it and whoop. And then puts it back. What and, STD does it say? Let me see. I don't. I, I read uh, an please. article. I don't think it's disease, but she also tested positive for. She said he gave me STD. I uh, had the rest for rest of my life. Yeah, Ooh. it was. It was like herpes, probably. Oh. She she already had herpes. Yeah. <laughs> Try to blame it on him. So he was a janitor. Is this at a school, a college? No, nah, office. Office. Damn. What 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 drives people to do some? That's it's like fun. Degenerate. I mean, yeah. I mean, I've I've seen people like. Like I remember, go on. <laughs> I, I've seen somebody like like take a water bottle, like rub their ass cheeks on it, and then like put it. Back. Dude, that's nasty, bro. Yeah, I was there. I worked, in, I worked in restaurants. Turn the other <laughs> cheek, man. I, I was, I've, I've seen some shit. Ugh, so I mean, uh, don't don't you feel bad about that? I've seen. Nah, some this shit chick was a bitch. Rest. Honestly, though, it was it was always the terrible people. Yeah, this chick was a straight up bitch. Wait, was it was like, a yeah. terrible people rubbing their buttholes on the pizza, or was it they were doing that to terrible people? They were doing it to terrible people. Yeah, yeah but, okay, but right. you're hearing this third party. No, I'm watching it. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I'm saying you're hearing their terrible people at third party. Or no, no, no. I'm seeing like, you're the seeing, awfulness. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, all right. Yeah, all right. when you work in a restaurant, like when somebody's being like super shitty, everybody's walking by the section, like watching it go down. Isn't isn't that the craziest <laughs> shit when somebody's super rude to restaurant or like any service yeah. worker? Like if you're around somebody and they're super fucking rude about shit, it's I don't know. To me, that's really awful. It, it the, is, the thing and, is it, and it's low effort to fuck with your shit. Yeah, right. you know yeah, what yeah. I mean. Exactly, like, and it's two su- things. It means two things. That person is not only rude, but they're dumb. Because you got yeah. you, you're dumb because if you don't realize that the people with the power in the kitchen that are making your food. Bro, they could drop a loogie in your fucking salad. No one's gonna fucking see, and no one gives a, no one gives a shit. Good, you know what yeah. I mean? You're dumb and you're rude. Yeah, they'll do it in front of everyone they work with. There's not they're yeah. not like hiding it. Like they will do it in front of everybody, and everybody will like cheer them on. Yeah, we all laugh. watched the movie with Ryan Reynolds, uh, Waiting. Yeah, right? Waiting. Cool. Have you seen that? Oh, dude, it's yeah. good. Dom, you gotta watch it. Yeah. Waiting. It's actually the, a classic. Yeah, yeah, sure. <laughs> this kid is working at Subway. He took a selfie of himself in the bathroom. And he had all like the slices of meat on the toilet seat. <laughs> oh, oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Weirdly satisfying. He went to jail. <laughs> he went to jail. Yeah, man, because he like he, put it back on serving it. Oh yeah, but he could just be like, "Oh, I ate them. They were for me." Nah. Oh, yeah, but, but how'd the picture get out though? <laughs> to I mean, be to be honest, that might have improved the meat at Subway. <laughs> How dare you that tuna sandwich? Uh, remember the one, uh, <laughs> That's nasty, bro. Oh, no. Remember the one at uh, Taco Bell where the the guy posted on Twitter. He's like at work right now, and he had his feet in the lettuce. Yeah, <laughs> said, and then they like it's pretty funny. It is kind of funny. But then they like ge- uh, they geolocated the picture because he left like the tag on there, and they figured out which uh, Taco oh. Bell, and he got arrested in like twenty minutes. Damn, yeah, from posting that. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Because wow. it like it was one of those things that just went viral like instantly. Yeah, and it then just they took just, off. Yeah, 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 they find out real <laughs> quick. Yeah. That's like funny, but not if I'm like eating at that Taco Bell. Yeah. But yeah, that's kind of. Funny. I mean, it's fair for funny, funny, Now but... I can't trust Taco Bell. Anymore. Yeah, <laughs> like really, the meat now. This <laughs> yeah. remember that trend of the ice cream like liquors? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. liquors. So wait, they open up the ice cream and lick, lick it and, it put, and it put it back. back yeah. yeah, and some of the people went to jail. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah she went to jail. Good man. Don't yeah, be good. licking my ice cream. Yeah, that's fucking gross. Yeah. I still eat it though. If I got it, and there was a tongue mark in it. I'd be like, oh fuck <laughs> it, dude. That's how I am, bro. I don't know how many times I'm eating food of their hair. I'm just like, ah. Yeah. Well, that's I like, don't give a fuck I about be, that. Shit. I be getting nervous of shit on Amazon now because now I like buy toothpaste and shit. And if it like doesn't come sealed, what? You know what yeah, I mean? no, no, uh, it comes sealed though. Do people? I mean, uh, I've bought I shit it. before, like electronics, and it came with like a not a like an actual weight, but like something to match the weight, and it, there was nothing in there. Mm-hmm. I'm like, where the fuck does this come from? Like, did they, and then I know they don't even take returns. Like, you know, when the, most return shit, yeah, I was, this is actually crazy. Most return shit goes straight to the dumpster. Yeah, no matter what, what it fuck? is. Yeah, yeah, Amazon's crazy like that. But hey, which dumpster? Yes. <laughs> Damn, Dom's that's, brain's that's the always right there. Or, or, Bro, that or the, come up. I mean, you can look on YouTube. You can look at the resellers. So people buy it, but they buy it in bulk. Oh, bulk a bunch of yeah, shit. Yeah, they buy like whatever. It'll just be it'll it'll be marked electronics, and it could be PS5s, or it could be you know whatever Tamagotchis or whatever. Yeah. Fucking you know, like you have no idea what you're Tamagotchis. buying. Tamagotchis. So hey, what's up with those Tamagotchis cute. though? Where are we going with that? 
Oh, 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 the weight thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, Amazon. That's yeah, but, yeah, but imagine you get, like, fake toothpaste and you don't even know. Exactly. Are you, but you're you're not, like, buying the only the Prime shit? You know no, no, I mean? but, oh, yeah. no, no, that doesn't even matter. I was like, yeah, what is, what I've is done that Amazon matter? before. It doesn't even matter. I've never had an issue with anything like that, though. I, but you probably bought from a third party and you it, you thought it was just coming oh, straight yeah, Prime? Oh, yeah, yeah, no, no, no. I'm not saying it's coming from Prime, but there's, uh-huh. like, the, the Prime, like, certified ones or whatever. Those are the ones that come from their, um... From their their shipping centers. Negative Ghost Rider. Sometimes. Most of the time, yeah. Not all the time, though. Yeah, you're like, like, because I could send it from my house. If my account got primed, I could send it from my facility or house. Yeah, or yeah, like, yeah, yeah. But like a lot of those ones are the ones where you keep your stock in like the the warehouses. A lot of them. Like are. That. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So. Does it, but that could have been something that was returned or you know not returned or sold to them yeah, or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I wonder who the fuck is. Oh, okay. I'm just joking. I wonder who's sitting on the uh, caffeine free Pepsi and selling twelve uh, selling a case of it for like thirty dollars. Supply and demand. On? Supply and yeah. demand. Because they say stop sell they stop making it. Yeah. And that, that was like my mom's favorite soda. You going? They should do it on eBay. Yeah, on, on fucking Amazon, they're like thirty five dollars for twelve. Are you gonna sell your PS five? Uh, keep it. I don't know. I think you should sell it. Yeah, yeah. Okay. That news came out. They're making like a. Um, they're making like a different version or upgraded. I don't even know how to say it, but like a different edition of the PS five. So and it's still it's got, hard it's got as a hell. Different skin. <laughs> no, it's got it's got some other shit like in, internals and shit. You know how they did that? They did that with a Nintendo Switch, just yeah. like the OLED, or they add. Yeah, something. they added a little. They something. fix something. You yeah, know? that's fucked up. They made them so hard to get, and then yeah. you finally get they one. Still, like, oh, no, no, no. They still, dude, has there, the regular has ones there, are still hard to get. Has there ever been mm-hmm. anything like this where, like, two and a half years in, you still can like barely fucking so. go out and get one? I, I can't think, think so. of something. Yeah. I mean, besides something that like not electronic like that, you know, yeah, where yeah, it yeah. seems like they'd be able to make more like collectible shit that may be a little yeah. different. But. So the regular PS5, I think it's going to be easier to get right after Christmas. So this might be your time, Dom. Sell that PS5 for twelve hundred. Yeah. What? Whoa! Yeah. Oh, what I'm, I'm, I'm 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 hitting motherfuckers over the head, boy. I'm, I'm trying to hit the <laughs> lotto. <laughs> Let's try to get rich, dude. Hey, I'm getting a lotto, man. I don't know if you get 1,200 anymore. No, no, no. no, no. no. Hey, look at for, prices on eBay for but, little Timmy. Five days before Christmas. Okay, <laughs> for a father that's never been in his life, he's gonna spend 1,200 dollars on to fucking make hey, his kid happy. Dom's outside of Toys R Us, like, <laughs> hey, you see this? Do you love your child? <laughs> <laughs> you haven't been there yet. This is the first Christmas you're gonna make. Make him happy with this fucking. Do you, you want to see your kid cry on Christmas? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> do it, Dom. Get that Spoil fucking. Well, that's little kid who would cry if he didn't get a PS5. Yeah, exactly. Probably kids don't even guys. deserve fucking PS5s, bro. You guys didn't even get tools when you were kids. <laughs> you probably all got PS5s when you were fucking three years old. You spoiled little brats. <laughs> never done no construction. Yo, never work with your hands. We gotta talk to old bird. I'm gonna talk to old bird. See, like, well, hey, what's what's Scoop building lately? What has he built lately? I, I changed the toilet seat like three days ago. <laughs> Tell you that much. <laughs> plastic screws. <laughs> No, he had the drill. Putting in work. <laughs> this, this guy's a regular engineer over here. Hey, I'm, I'm putting in work, baby. I'm putting in work. Respect. Respect. Yeah, I'm going to call Scoop to come over and help paint my fucking... Whoa, apartment. whoa. I painted this whole fucking place. <laughs> Did you really? By myself. It looks oh, like shit. I was shit. There. It looks what? like ass. Come on, this is this nice paint. Bro, there's streaks. I didn't want to say anything, but fuck. I mean, I painted over paint. <laughs> Dude, you shit, Donnie, man. You spent hours in here. I did, it. I did. I'm going to come in here and put some other shit up. Yeah, please posters. do. Britney Spears posters. All right, let's get out of here. We're getting uh, silly. Yeah. No, man. Yeah, I didn't get out of here. Let's go. I love you guys. All right, All right thank you. Peace.